that enemy you face, his name means bribe in Romanian. Is that what it? Mita? Interesting. Keep loot. win trade name. I'm just helping him out. He bribed me, so gave him the win. I'll cycle the inner rage on the acolyte. Our hand is pretty bad right now. Especially yeah, two inner rages. Definitely need to cycle this. You just have wrath too. Raven Idol's most likely not Cthune. Wow, mulch. That's pretty conservative. Barone Gadon is not bad. Pretty good, because I think this is a token druid, so Barone Gadon could do some serious work here. Let's play no charge. Should, should. I don't even have enough mana to charge the Acolyte. Save, I'll save Vicar. It's activated for the pyro. He executes. Wallet Warrior confirmed. Yeah, I know. I'm running a legendary here. Living Roots, Coin, Power of the Wild. We don't have enough mana to play Baronga Don't yet. As long as it's not Soul of the Forest, though. If he innervates out Soul of the Forest, that's super annoying. And we have a good clear if we get um, Wild Pyro. I guess we trade here first. No Wild Pyro. Do you think he has lethal? Probably should execute this so he doesn't get any more tokens. And then we have we have Baronga down to clear the board. So I think this just goes face. You lied to me now I can't get my sweet you see red karma. I know. Yeah, we're not doing so hot tonight. Don't have second power of the wild. Just hero power trade in. We get to play Baronga Don. Seems like he's afraid to use a uh, face for here power. Oh, we don't we don't play Brongadon. We actually have lethal, right? If he if he here powers. Oh, at least he has balls. He's got dead balls. This ain't no free to play warrior. I know. What the heck is this? What's this? So your wild pyromancer evolved to burn again. Yeah, I figure I want to be more pay to win, so. Wild Pyros or Berengadon. I actually substitute two Pyros for two Berengadons. I figure one's not enough. Gotta assert some dominance. Same guy, so he knows what we are now. He knows we're OTK, so he won't be as... Um, he won't be trying to get that much value from pure power, I guess. 
Wow. I just have Icar to activate Acolyte. Double charge. Gonna charge Acolyte. Acolyte of Barongadonga. It's probably confused. People will see Corcoran, they're gonna think it's Tempo. They're not gonna think it's OTK. Because it, the only OTK list they know of is not mine. They only know quote unquote Neville's OTK list. Do I give him Enrage on Acolyte, or do I coin out the Icar? Do I value coin or Enrage more? I think I value coin since we have the Pyro now. Streams that I think he wouldn't have traded there, right? So I can do Ravaging Wall, Icar, trade in. I can save Task then for the charge. It's got plenty of whirlwind effects. How many taunts does a token druid run? Depends on if they run Ancient War. Ancient War and Scenarius. I guess he runs Druid. That's not... This is not standard though. I don't think everybody runs Druid the Claw. if we value the Ravaging Ghoul more, or the coin. Cause I could, okay, I could use Tass and the coin on loot. That's one option. But I think we saved the coin for the Pyro. So he's seen both Ravaging Ghouls, so he probably thinks it's safe to play Teacher. stuff next turn. so bad on that one. He plays Ysera in this list. Alright, this is... I have no idea. Oh, never mind. That's off of Raven Idol. I was gonna say, this list is so greedy. Battle Rage. And then we have to drop something before we... Before we run the Acolyte in. Probably give up the weapon. re -quip. I think that means his spells are not that good. He doesn't actually think he can finish with the spells. So that's why he's looking for minions. The 
Sierra from Idol. It's, it's fine. I think we, the first combo we should just use a task. We'll save the second combo with Wild Pyro. The reason is you can actually couple in Or we can just do double core front. I guess that works. The reason why you save Pyro for the second combo is you can do you can do Pyro, Worgen Charge, and Execute. So that way you can get through a taunt if he plays. Uh, so we can just use, like use Task and Charge and stuff because you can't execute while also playing this stuff. Raise Yog. Brawl. One of mine. Okay, good. I feel like once Yog dies, this spell should stop. Savage Roar. Okay, reasonable. Reasonably dead. Yeah, so skilled. That's why I hate this kind of deck. I mean, yeah, it can win you or lose a game, but either way, it's it's just stupid. When your combo cards and the last four cards feels bad, man. Yeah, it does does feel bad, Chiefs. But it should be very rare that it happens when you run double combo. Reasonably dead balls. Coming noises back. Alright. That should have fixed it. I don't see a large background. Well, top one NA was playing Yog Druid without Yog. <laughs> so just a token Druid then. I hate a card that can single handedly win or lose a game due to RNG. Yeah, that's basically Yogg. Yogg in a nutshell. Keep this in case it's token. If I know it if I know it's Cthune, I'll probably toss this. This is not that useful. If Warrior have tracking, uh that'd be well, Control Warrior would never run tracking, because that's not a value card you throw away. You throw away cards, that's bad for fatigue. But, yeah, for combo... No, not necessarily true either. What if you're tracking through, like, multiple combo pieces? Warrior already has great enough card draw, it doesn't need stuff like tracking. Eleven spells in a Reno deck. Do you think I should be running Yag or Alex instead? Um, Alex is pretty hard to use these days. It's pretty clunky for healing and for offensive. Alex, unless you're running a dragon deck, I don't think I'd run Alex. If you tracking or give him work and charge or enrich, or all three at the same time, wouldn't that feel bad? It's not about me, it's about you. You're the one that's gonna play the deck, not me. So you know it's all it's all up to you what you want to play. 
You will just be dead to me, Kappa. Do you think this is better than the usual OTK deck? Um, what are you referring to when you say usual? Are you saying the Commanding Shout version? Commanding Shout... It has, it has a lot of board clear potential and it has a lot of card draw. The problem is it only runs one copy of each combo piece. So it could be inconsistent in terms of drawing combo by a certain time. Like you'll you'll draw a combo eventually. The question is, do you have enough time to draw it against all all types of decks? This one is aiming to have combo by turn eight. I thought you run Alex in your control warrior. Um I don't have a standard control warrior list. Like it's it's definitely not fixed at all. Execute would have been so huge here. Do Corcoran, and we can just trade the whole board in. And then I give it an inner rage as well. <coughs> Somehow I don't really like doing that. I think I'll just do this. You know, I don't even feel like cashing the Gnomish. I feel like we're just gonna try to execute this. We have two executes in the deck. We're trying to find it with um, the Gnomish. Two executes for these two big boys. Maybe just ramp druid. There's one execute. It's a good start. So I thought we could do Ravaging Ghoul. Uh, uh, Ravaging Ghoul, Ravaging Ghoul, Corcoran, and Rage. And that kills one of them. Leaves the other one damaged so we can execute it later. What's the other option? The other option is... Using Pyro instead of Ravaging Ghoul to trigger the execute. Desert. All Yag decks are OTK, you just have to believe. Yeah, you just have to play enough spells and it's OTK. Possibly OTK on yourself, but who cares, right? Alright, finally got through the big boys. You just use one swipe. I'm not sure about dropping the pyro there. Like, armoring up should make sure we don't die. I haven't seen any Drew the Claws. So it's still token. It's just a very defensive version that runs two Ancient Wars. So let's start Pyro Slam. I guess I can Icker. Icker Battle Rage task. If I task first, I could have gotten extra Battle Rage. That was a misplay. Kind of 
kind of, I don't know. Vanish. Okay. So he's gonna play Yogg again and kill himself, right? I feel like animation should still stop. Heal me, heal me, heal me. Thank you. Bash your face. Bash your own face. Nice. Oh. He actually hasn't played all that many spells. Anyways. We have 20 damage in hand. We should get the axe equipped. Now we have two copies combo. The thing is, his Yogg takes up the whole turn again. So, let's say he plays Yogg and it is like a dud Yogg. Doesn't play any secrets. Doesn't heal his face. Then we have uh, we have 23 damage. Discover Deathwing. 10 mana vanish. I don't have a second Raging Morgan for this deck. Can I sub in Yogg and Saran? How do you have Yogg's run in that second Morgan? But, sure, I guess, if you want to do Yogg style. People already did that, though, with the commanding shot list, they put in Yogg. I don't know what they cut, though. Praise Yogg. Your own face? As long as it doesn't play any secrets and doesn't heal, I'm fine. No secrets and no heal. What secrets can I play around? I can play around Snipe because I picked up Banner Rage. So we could test for Snipe like this. Yes! We did it! We played around Snipe. Stream Snipe. I have a good night, Faber. What can we say? Fuck, fuck Yag. Right? Or it should be Yak Fog, I guess, to be more politically correct. Lock is sniping confirm. Hey, bring your own kazoo. How's it going? Your ear, sorry. I was trying to say yuck fog, but then I screwed up. And I just said <laughs> I just said it. Yuck fog. Apologize to all the virgin ears out there. I guess I should change stream title to mature. Alright, freeze. <laughs> Icker? Icker's pretty good. What is the chat today? I think that's the first that's the first outburst really. Jazz actually has to do some modding today. You could have ooze. I don't really care. I mean, I do care. But not enough to give up the huge advantage of having Axe on turn 2. I probably should use Vicker too. This sets up a Rapture will clear on this guy. In K 
case he puts a taunt in the way and you can't actually hit, <coughs> hit it again. So he plays Imp Gang Boss, this trades, we hit, we play Ratchet and Cool. Can I replace the charges for Yaga and Alex? You might as well just play Control Warrior at that point, but yeah. Is this Michael Jackson on guitar? This is somebody else playing guitar. I don't know if Michael Jackson is actually on the guitar. It seems OTK were exploded, and you were the only person streaming it. Pretty cool. Uh, well, there's a lot, a lot of people streaming it now, but I wouldn't say I'm the only person. Neville's was streaming it for a while too, even before the, even before OTK came out. Like he would occasionally play my list on his stream. This is locked on guitar. Yes, I'm currently sitting on the guitar, which is being played. to drop the Ravaging Ghoul. It's only a 1-1 one, one on board. Yeah, before it got cool. It took a while for people to catch on. The OTK is actually pretty OP. And it's actually pretty consistent too. I think that's the main thing, consistency. Like, people thought the combo was OP itself, but they didn't realize how consistent it was. I don't think I need to waste the axe there. Aw, hey Fuinez! Glad to be here. Thank you so much for the four months of sub. It's a lock hype for you. Welcome back to the Loch Ness Monsters. <laughs> What's with the stinky cheese hype? Yeah, welcome back, Venus. Oh, you got punished. And his board is pretty weak to Pyro. I just do Pyro, Slam. I guess if I want to cycle both slams, then I do Pyro Slam Slam. This way I get a card draw from both slams. We are a little bit vulnerable to Forbidden Ritual now, since I use the Pyro. And I don't have second... Uh, second Ravaging Ghoul or Second Pyro in hand. So, this is the one turn if he streams sniping. He should go for the Forbidden Ritual. Tap. Forbidden Ritual. Have you given your opinions on commanding shout lists? Um, I think it's I think it's fine. It does well at the matchups that OTK is good against, but it still has significant weaknesses. Yeah, I don't think it's necessarily that consistent. Against decks that can pressure you a lot early on, like Tempo Dragon Warrior, you'll be hard pressed to find your single copies of combo. Guys, we can execute that. Kind of want to enrage the Acolyte too, and get some card draw. Actually, here's another thing. We could use organ to organ for clear. I think that's not too crazy.
needs Leroy P.O.P.O. P.O. I will make a meme about later about charging loot order. Alright, sounds good. Why not Rampage in this deck? Because you don't need it. Taskmaster is way more flexible. And you have two copies of combo, so against some of the control decks you can just combo them twice. Alright, cool. He has to use Soulfire. Do you play Freeze Mage anymore? So fun and interactive. I haven't played Freeze Mage. I haven't found like a Freeze Mage list that I really like. He's just going YOLO, discard everything. I guess that's not... I don't know what that is. Nice Acre. Namish. I would trade this, Execute. Lucky, the top deck to execute. Try lapping Reno Freeze, it's great. I think Freeze is actually pretty good in the meta. It beats the OTK decks, it beats Zoo. Um, I'm not sure how it does against Tempo. Tempo Dragon. I guess it depends on if they get if they get Rag in time. Rag is the best way for them to pressure. Wow, that charge doesn't want to get in here, huh? I can pull that 9 9 card to 30 30 charge. I'll buy one week of Boba. <laughs> the next meme deck. Alright, so he has a PO. All his POs are gone. Never charge. Just want to show them I have two copies of combo. It's not the dance game list that everyone's playing. <laughs> 